So quite recently in the comment section, somebody asked me what the little disco box I was wearing on my shoulder. And the simple answer is, it is a Zoleo satellite communicator. Now, I received this from Zolio for free back in March. I travelled down to Manchester and I got to meet the team plus some other YouTubers. We were all given a device each to test, but none of us are under any obligation whatsoever to review this. So this is off my own back and it will be completely honest. So let's get stuck right in. So first things first, the device, it weighs 160 grams. That includes the little carabiner clip. The dimensions are 91 millimeters by 66 by 27. So the battery inside is 1,430 milliamps. This should give you around 200 hours of usage time. This is involving sending a message every 12 minutes. In real terms for me, I've got between five and seven days use out of this and that's leaving it on anywhere between seven and nine hours a day. The satellite system is the Iridium one and the SOS service is the Global Rescue, which I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, is the same one that Garmin use as well. So whilst this is a satellite communicator, it also has Wi-Fi. So if you're on a Wi-Fi signal, it would send the message via Wi-Fi. If there's no Wi-Fi available, it would then switch to mobile data. If there's no mobile data, then finally it would use the satellite. The reason for this is to save you using up your messages that you get with the plan, which I'll go into more detail later on as well. I think the Wi-Fi is a bit of a gimmick. I get the mobile data, um, but either way, you will get a signal out, providing this has a clear view of the sky above. The Zoleo is rubberized. I don't know if you can see that in the camera. It's really tough. You can drop this and it will take a drop, no problem at all. Just like that. It is waterproof down to 1.5 meters for half an hour and it's also dust proof as well. This is pretty basic as a device. To look at it, there's only three buttons. So on the side here, you power it up. Just hold it down for a few seconds. That's it powered up, and there's a the power button. The second button, you've got it here, you'll see it's like a, like a tick on it. That is just a check-in, so you can, whatever plan you're on, you get unlimited check-ins. So if you're out and about, you just want to let your partner or family member know that you're fine, you just hit that once. That will then send a message out to your partner, no problem. The third and last button on this is the SOS button which is obviously should be kept for emergencies. And if you take that off under the flap there, you'll see the SOS button. To activate this, you just hold it down for three seconds. That's it in emergency mode, it'll start spinning red. And you've got five seconds to cancel this, so I'm just gonna hold it down. Hope it's registered that. That should be cancelled. Hopefully nobody will come knocking on the door shortly. So that is how you work it. Hold it down for three seconds. You get that 10 second countdown and you've got hold it down for five seconds to cancel that. Um, obviously you're not going to cancel it in a real life emergency. Just let it go. That will then contact the Global Rescue Centre who will then contact the UK emergency services or whatever country that you're in and then hopefully come out and rescue you. So like I said earlier, there is only three buttons on this. It's very simple. If you don't want to use your phone, you could just hit the OK button, let whoever know that you're OK, and you've got that get out of jail free card as well. But the real magic with this device is when you connect it up with the Zoleo app. And what we'll do is we'll fire it up on my phone, <clears throat> and I'll just give you a quick tour and just show you what you've got. It's a really user-friendly app, by the way. I love it. It's I think that's one place I've really gone to town on is the design of the app. So here we are here, you can just see I've got my medical assist. If I click on that, you can ask for non-emergency medical advice and it can take up to 10 minutes to get a message back. So it could be like you've cut yourself badly, you're not quite sure about first aid or you found somebody, 
you can get medical advice. So that's a nice touch. You see here as well, I've got my mum, I've got my partner Nicola, I've got my friend Kevin and Anne and my dad. This is just like basically like WhatsApp. It's just a, a, a messaging service. So you can see my mum there worried about me get off the hills. It's getting dark. Um, what I'll do, I need to watch because it does show people's numbers if I click on it. If I go to um, my mum, I'll just uh, send her a quick test. And that message is sending off to my mum. What to do is whoever you choose to be set up as your emergency contacts, get them to download the Zulio app as well. That means that you get up to 900 characters rather than just the standard 160 characters. So it just expands what you, you and your partner can do via the app. You can also request a weather location, um, sorry, a weather forecast. So you can see here, just use current location and that will then compute a weather forecast for wherever I am, which is really good. I've used that before. You can take a screenshot so you're not constantly needing to go back in and get it. You've got the SOS. So again, you would just hold down the SOS button for three minutes, eh, sorry, three seconds. And then you can obviously cancel that within the app. I'm not going to try that just in case. And then you've got the settings here as well. I'm not going to go through all the settings because it'll be quite a long video otherwise, but this is my favourite part of the, the Zolio app is the check-in location. So if you go to location share there, you'll see there I've got it switched on. So as soon as I switch this on, this will start pinging back my location to whoever I've got set up, which is my mum and my partner. You can see there in the app, I've set that to 30 minute intervals. You can do it as little as six minutes. You can see the caveat there, it just warns you it's high battery usage. You've got 12 minutes, 30 minutes, one hour default, two hours, four hours, low batteries. So if you're out on a big expedition, you probably want to do the four hours. For me, I'm usually out for the weekend, so I just do, I think 30 minutes is probably the sweet spot. It just creates the breadcrumb. So what I'll do now is just show you what the breadcrumbs look like for you and your partner. I'll just find one of the maps. Where are we? So here we go. This is a big hike that I did a few weeks ago. So number one there, that's at the buffet. And then you can see me going uphill, two, three and four, onto the ridge, five at the summit. Oh no, sorry, seven's the summit, or eight even. <laughs> Get it right, Robin. And then we obviously headed off the summit, we descended back down, 11's at the bottom, 12 is heading back up, and then 17 is the second summit of the day, and then you can see there, heading back down the ridge, and then back to the car there. So that is how the breadcrumbs looks like. Really good. My partner really likes this. She always worries about me when I'm away, and this just gives her total peace of mind. So to go out and buy this right now would cost you £199 brand new. So they have undercutted some of their rivals. Where people will decide which device they want will be based on the plans that Zoleo offer. And I'll run through the basics of each plan just now. So the basic plan will cost you £18 per month. For this, you get 25 customised messages. The next one up is the In Touch which is the middle plan, for that you'll get 250 customizable messages. And finally is the unlimited plan, which you'll get obviously unlimited messages to your friends and loved ones. Now, there is a £23 activation fee regardless of which plan you take. So the device, like I said, is 199 Then you've got your one-off activation fee, which is £23. And then you've got your monthly subscription, which is either £18, £32 or £58. For an extra £4.50, you also can get the location share, which basically you decide in the app how many times a day you will send your location. Okay, to summarise on the Zuleo satellite communicator, I really can't fault it. It does everything I need it to do. I've got that get out of jail free card, the SOS button. 
I can communicate with anybody I want as long as I've got their number and the location share is excellent. I just forget all about it and just let it ping away so my missus can follow my progress when I'm ever out on the mountains. If I was to be really picky, it is a, it's a shame they've gone with micro USB charge port rather than USB-C. It's a minor niggle, it's not a showstopper. Some might think it's slightly on the bulky side. It's the same size, well roughly, as a pack of playing cards. So it's not really that big, although it is bigger than some of the competitors. But once you've got it stuck on your rucksack strap or it's on your belt, you're not going to notice it, it's there. You can even put it in the top pocket of your rucksack as long as it's near the top you will get messages out. There's no screen on this. That isn't a deal breaker for me. If you've tried to text on an inReach Mini, you're having to scroll through the alphabet. It takes an age to text. You can still get that important SOS message even without your phone. So it's not a deal breaker not having a screen. So yeah, other than that, that is pretty much it. If you've watched this far, thank you very much. If you've got any questions or something I've not covered in this video, please let me know in the comment section below. Otherwise, cheers and I will catch you in the next one.